मैं डॉक्टर राजेश उपाध्याय मैं डायरेक्टर एंड हेड डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ गैस्ट्रोइंट्रोलॉजी मैक्स हॉस्पिटल शालीमार बाग में हूँ और डायरेक्टर इक्शा इंडियन कन्फेडरेशन ऑफ हेल्थ केयर अक्रेडिटेशन विच इज़ ए ऑर्गेनाइजेशन फॉर क्वालिटी इन हेल्थ केयर आई एम ऑल्सो द पास्ट प्रेसिडेंट ऑफ द एसोसिएशन ऑफ फिजिशन ऑफ इंडिया एंड वॉज प्रीवियसली द चेयरमैन ऑफ डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ गैस्ट्रो इंट्रोलॉजी एट जयपुर गोल्डन हॉस्पिटल एंड हैव बिन द इंटरनेशनल एडवाइजर फॉर द रॉयल कॉलेज ऑफ फिजिशंस इन ग्लासगो वेल इट हैज़ बिन अ प्राउड मोमेंट टूडे दैट आई रिसीव द बी सी रॉय अवार्ड इन द कैटेगरी ऑफ डेवलपमेंट ऑफ स्पेशलिटी एंड I have done a lot of work in developing gastroenterology in the country uh, uh, both in terms of research uh, in terms of clinical care in terms of endoscopic care and in terms of education for the physicians at large we have even published uh, at least 5 publications which were widely distributed and these were relating to common diseases of the gastrointestinal tract such as gastrointestinal reflux disease diarrhea uh, acid peptic diseases which are common conditions which occur in this country uh, in in that respect i uh, when i was the uh, president of the association i ensured because physicians at large were uh, predominantly interested in cardiology and diabetology and i felt that gastroenterology was not getting the place it deserved therefore i managed to popularize it and ensured that all the state chapters uh, were uh, putting gastroenterology uh, subjects in their conferences so that there could be adequate teaching for gastroenterology my uh, message to all doctors is very simple i feel that uh, for all practicing doctors there are only three components which are important one is competence which is what we have acquired at the medical school but more importantly the continuing cmes which we attend and uh, we enhance our knowledge and skills in these cmes therefore it is of utmost importance that doctors do attend the cmes held not only in their subjects but broaden their horizon by uh, attending cmes of related subjects as well the other aspect of a doctor's personality should be compassion and i am very uh, particular about this particularly when teaching my juniors and all my colleagues we have to be compassionate towards our patients and lastly it is the communication so competence compassion and communication and communication is something which is not really part of the curriculum in our undergraduate or postgraduate teaching and i feel that uh, it requires a lot of training and doctors must receive soft skills training particularly communication skills because it is this lack of communication which leads to majority of the medical legal cases in our country and there is a report today i saw that the number of cases are exponentially rising it is just because of lack of communication not because the doctor community is incompetent or is not compassionate lastly uh, to our community i have a very clear message there has been seen that there is a mistrust in the recent times between the patient and the doctors and i want to assure that even today majority of the doctors working in this country are working for the patient we are all trying to improve patient care improve compassion improve communication so let us not live in an environment of mistrust i would urge everyone to please trust the doctors and build up a better relationship thank you very much